CPS has many built-in tools for working with other programs and file types. One of the most powerful tools is the ability to use CPS and PowerPoint presentations together. There are two different ways to do this. The first method is from within your CPS database. The second method is through our other application, CPS for PowerPoint. First, let's look at delivering a PowerPoint presentation from within your CPS database. Open your CPS database and click on the Prepare tab. Then, click on Lessons and Assessments. Select the lesson or folder to which you want to add the PowerPoint file. Click Add Files from the Lessons group on the ribbon. The Add Files window opens. Locate the PowerPoint file you wish to add to your CPS database, then click Open. The PowerPoint file appears in the lesson or folder you selected. Now we'll see how to deliver the PowerPoint presentation and gather responses. Click the Engage tab, then click on Lessons and Assessments. Select the PowerPoint presentation you want to deliver to your class by placing a check into the box next to its title. In the Engage Options group on the ribbon, enter a title, session type, and select a class. Then click the Engage button on the ribbon. The presentation will open with the CPS Verbal Engage bar at the bottom of the screen. Note that this is all being done from within CPS. You do not need Microsoft PowerPoint open alongside of CPS. You can navigate through your presentation as you normally would in Microsoft PowerPoint. When you want to have your students respond to a question, click the Verbal button on the toolbar and select the appropriate question type. Gather responses as you normally would, and click End to close the current question. Once a question is closed, the charting feature will appear. This will allow you to view instant feedback and select a correct answer for the question. Choosing a correct answer will save the information. If you do not choose a correct answer, the question data will not be saved. Once you are done with the presentation, click the Close button on the Engage toolbar, confirm you wish to end that lesson, and CPS will take you back to the Engage tab. The results are available under the Reports tab for immediate evaluation. For more information on the Reports tab, please watch the video titled CPS Reports. This concludes the training video for delivering a PowerPoint presentation in CPS.